Hey, it's Sebastian from Skycomp Solutions, and today I'm going to show you the top five keyboard shortcuts in Microsoft Teams. So let's jump right in here. So the first one I'm going to show you is Control Shift M, which is to mute or unmute yourself in a meeting. So the first thing we got to do is get a meeting going. And all you have to do is hit Control Shift M, and then you'll see on the screen that you're muted. Um, and it gives you a little bit of a notification up at the top of the screen as well. And then the other thing you're going to want to do to unmute yourself is the same keystroke. So you just go Control Shift M and then you're unmuted and everyone can hear you in the meeting. So that's a really simple shortcut, but it comes in handy when you, you know, when you're using the cursor and you have to go up and you got to find it, you got to click on it. And sometimes if you're using a laptop with a mouse pad, it gets a little bit complicated because sometimes it doesn't click properly or you, you know, you have papers on it or whatever the case. It's just easier to go over and hit Control Shift M and then you're muted or unmuted. The next keyboard shortcut is one that is for the video. Um, so it's Control Shift O for turning your video on and off. Um, so I can show you that now just hopping over to this uh, computer. So it's the same two first keystrokes as the muting one, but you just go Control Shift O and then it shuts your video off. You can see in the bottom um, right corner that my video went out and on the other side of the call that the other person in the call cannot see me anymore. So now that our camera's off, we can turn it back on again. So all we have to do is go to Control Shift O and open that up again. So then we can see on the other call that I am, I'm here again. So the next one is in the chat features. So we're in the chat menu. We want to start a new chat with someone. It's very similar to creating a new project or in Word or creating a new document in Photoshop. It's very similar to that. It's just Control N for Control New. And we have a new chat already popped up in front of us. Really, really simple. Um, all you have to do is search the person you're looking for. I'll search for myself and we can start uh, a chat. So now that we're in a chat, we can show you another really great shortcut. Um, and that is using the up arrow key when you send a message and you make a mistake. So the example I'm going to give here is uh, Sky Solutions. Oh shoot, I just said Sky Op Solutions. We don't want that. So I can just immediately hit the up arrow and then go on over, make that edit, and then hit enter again. So I'll show you that on this camera here, just so you can see, uh, I'm just hitting this arrow key right here and we fixed it. So it's fairly straightforward. Just hit the up arrow right here and that will immediately jump into the editor mode. You can also go to it again, right click it, edit, and then the same thing happens. But I think it's way faster to just immediately hit the up arrow after you're done and you realize you made the mistake. It makes you uh, look a lot better in chats when you're uh, chatting with, te with, a t with a team or, or coworkers and you make a mistake and before anyone can point it out, you can correct it. So it's a pretty sweet uh, little shortcut. The fifth and final shortcut is Control O and that is to attach a file. So I'm gonna show you that over on this computer here. All we have to do is hit Control O and then it asks if we wanna upload that file from our computer or if we wanna to go to OneDrive. You can do either option. I'm just going to select a file from my computer. We're going to go to downloads and we're just going to upload a call that we had a couple days ago for another tutorial. We're going to upload that file. So that's going to upload there for you. You can send it just like you would send a normal file. This works for documents. You can surf anywhere on your computer or in OneDrive for any file that you want and upload it. So it's just control O. It's a great little shortcut. This has been the top five keyboard shortcuts in Microsoft Teams. If you found any of this helpful, you can click the subscribe button over here. And if you'd like to see other videos on Microsoft Teams, you can click over here. And if you'd like to see other playlists about solving technology, you can click over here. Thanks for watching.